Hi Thomas. Right, just going over what we talked about yesterday. I'll just show you what happens at the top. So at the top, obviously, this section here gets flattened down with a lump hammer, so that's nice and flat, but it'll always create, there'll always be a little bit of a ridge there. Um, when we put the foam in, the foam comes up and protrudes beyond, and the foam is cut to fit that shape. Okay, so that, that will fit there, and the lid will come over the top, just so we can see that. So going back to this issue about the, this piece kicking up, when I put that in place there, there's a bit of a gap here. And I would agree that there is potential, when weight comes on, for the front to be lifted up here. So the solution to that is quite simply to bend that along there, bend that forwards like that. Just like that. So that is bent forwards, okay. Now, when this is put on there, okay, it's pinned, it's, it's already pre-bent. So by the time we put the tape on, that will be absolutely stuck on there. And then when we put any more weight on the back, I'll bend it a tiny bit more, just to really show the point. I'm gonna do this without any tape, okay? So now, that's absolutely down at the back. So, once we lock it in place with these screws, I'll just do it fingertip tight for now. Back me, just chuck me that drill. I'll just grab this drill, speed it up. Okay, so when we just lock these two in place. Okay. Now, even if I put my foot on the back there and push, it's going nowhere. Okay, so especially, don't forget, we'll already have that tape behind there, which will have gripped it and held that absolutely fixed. But now, it doesn't matter what weight is applied behind it, any roofing that goes on there, that sticks flat. Okay, hope you get that. Cheers.